Hi guys. Ooh, guess I should have done something with my hair before I did this video. <laughs> I've missed you all. <laughs> I'm sorry I've been on my A and thank you so much to everybody who's reached out to check that I was okay. Um, apparently I decided that having a bum knee wasn't bad enough. I decided to throw out my back. So I've been <laughs> two weeks getting to the point where I can move around. I couldn't even comfortably sit at a computer to um, edit videos or anything. Because I have some stuff shot and I couldn't sit long enough to edit. I can put my hands in front of me again. It's right here in my low back. So bringing my arms forward would put pressure on that spot and I couldn't do it. But... Being as how it was February, February already sucks, and someone needs to take away my access to a credit card in February. Um, <laughs> we all know I spend too much time on TikTok. Well, I got sucked into Crystal Scoops. They're now banned from TikTok. I got in just before the ban, and I have ordered a bunch. I'm not going to tell you how much, but we're going to have a bunch of crystal scoop unboxing. These are lucky scoops. So this one is from Highland Crystals and I think this was a two scoop order. I think. I love crystals. Okay, I just, I love the pretty rocks. Pretty polished rocks. I love them. Um, and I thought, what the heck, I'm going to do it because I need something to bring me joy right now. And it's only been actually about a week since I ordered this and it's here already. So we're going to do an unboxing and I'll show you my pretty rocks. So while I can't do fiber stuff, we can at least do this and have some fun. So let me adjust the camera. I've got my gear here so we can get into it. I'm so excited. <laughs> I have no idea which box this is. I did screen record. So uh, when I edit, I'll pop that in here. But we're just going to get right to the box. I'm not going to even remember what's in this scoop, so it's going to be like a big surprise. It's going to be fun. <laughs> okay, let's get into it. Three scoop. Scoop one. Number two. Tammy, longer the lion. Lion. Okay, copy that. Number three, the cube. One gone. Last three cube. Last three. Big Q, Flower Stone, and a juicy Agus Star. Big Boy, Canelian, and the Rose Cross Mountain. Palm Stone, Fire Cross, Rainbow Fluorite, and the Smoky Cross Flame. Rodenite, Canelian, Juicy Agus Heart Shake, Green Adventuring, Smoky Cross, and La Borderite. Also, Polychrome Mushroom, Fly Agus Star Shade, Mose Agus, and more Canelian, La Borderite. Also, Smoky Falls and the Canelian for you. Thank you, honey. Tammy wants the lion. Lion in your bag now. Your five skip freebie. All right, I got my knife. I'm going to cut my way in. Now, how the Crystal Lucky Scoops work is they take all of their crystals and they put them in a big tumbler. It's a, like a crystal polisher and they have little gel beads that are in there. And they throw the crystals in and they just kind of move around in this big tumbler. And then they just take a scoop and they scoop it up. Now I've put in the footage, hopefully, so you'll have seen them drawing my scoops. So, here we go. Let's get a look inside this box. Oof. It's all in one big bundle, I think. Yep. All right, let me lift this. Oh, there is a card. So there's the Highland Crystal thank you card. And there's the information. Now, watching this is completely addicting. Just watching it is entertaining. Um, and there's a chat, live chat going on. And the hosts are, are crazy. Uh, I believe these ones were drawn by Kiki, who is just adorable. Um, my favorite is Kiki and Ian are two of my favorite hosts. And that's how you know I've been watching way too many Lucky Scoops on TikTok. But it kept me entertained when 
I was in a lot of pain, so you know, what the heck. Okay, there we go. Wow, oh my goodness. I think this is my five crystal scoop. I think this was the one I was really, really excited and waiting for, but let's find out. So here, I can tell it's a cube. They're all individually wrapped in bubble wrap to keep them in good shape during shipping. Now, I am no crystal expert, and I probably won't know the names of most of these, but we can look at them and say, ooh, how pretty. <laughs> and then I can build my crystal collection. <gasps> oh, oh, it's so pretty. Oh my gosh, that's heavy. Heavy and cold, which is what they say to tell you have real crystals. Look at those colors. And it's got like the one corner, so you can sit it on that one corner and have it like this. Let me see if I can show you. Put it up here. There. So it can sit like this. That's cool. Okay, let's try another one. Oh! Oh, it's a sh mushroom house carving. Look at it. It's got like a little chimney and there's a little flower on it and a little front door. Oh, that's so pretty. But look at this peach stripe right here. How pretty is that? And I'm telling you, this is ice cold and heavy. Oh, this one looks like palm stones. Now, my favorite, of course, because I love the flash and the chaos, Labradite is like my favorite stone. Um, but I also love so many of them. Okay, so this would be, I imagine they would call it an obsidian, but it's like a little dish, so like a sphere holder. We may need this because I got spheres, baby. I got spheres, they're multiplying. <gasps> oh. Look at this one. So this is a carnelian palm stone. Look at that color. It's fantastic. And there's some little quartz inclusions. It's so pretty. It's a labradite heart. Let's see if we can get some flash showing here. There you go. You can see some of the flash right there. That's what I love about labradite. Oh, so pretty. It's a rose quartz palm stone. Look at the color though. That's not just a light rose. That's like a seriously deep rose. Oh, it's so pretty. Okay. We have another carnelian palm stone. Look at the color. Let me get this a little closer. Like, look at, look how pretty that is. Oh, and it just fits in my hand so Agate star because it's translucent and you can see the patterns but there is literally a hole that goes all the way in so this entire bit here is like a little cave it's very dirty right now but these are all going to get a really good bath I'm going to spend hours just staring at these this would be a fluorite tower look at that that is so pretty now they do put glue on the tips just to protect the point but look at the colors on that all right here's the flashlight and if we put it behind it you can see how the light travels through it how pretty the little inclusions inside are more palm stones <gasps> oh my god look at the patterning on this so this would be a moss agate i would think or a tree agate it's depending on the patterning depends on what they're called but look at the patterns on that it is absolutely stunning now i am not like big heart lover but i don't care the form it takes when it looks like that it's fantastic oh my gosh look at this clear quartz with those yellow inclusions like this is so clear it is gorgeous 
Oh, another carnelian palm stone. Look at this. It's got the quartz inclusions here. It's got a little black one there. But look at the color of it. Oh, <laughs> it's another carnelian palm stone. Apparently, in all my orders, I think I have carnelian. Apparently, I really need it. This one's got a little pocket there. Oh, look at this side with that clear quartz and the carnelian. Absolutely stunning. These are some littler tumbles. Oh my goodness. Look at the rainbows in this one. I don't know if it'll focus in. But it's got little crystal pockets that have rainbows in them. Now I think this is some gray labradorite. There is, I don't know if you're going to be able to see the flash. It can be really hard to get the flash on camera. But there is a color flash right up here. Oh, you can see a little bit of it down here. So that's labor labradorite. Oh my goodness. Just a little agate heart, but it's just got subtle smoky colors in there. It's so pretty. Oh my goodness. And look at this. We got all of this open already and we still have all of this stuff here to go. Is this where I drew confessions? I have five more boxes coming. <laughs> I went crystal shopping. I got another lab palm stone. I don't know if we're going to be able to get the flash. Oh, there was a bit of one right there. You can see a little bit. Look at this heart. And it's got little druzy pockets. You see those little crap flashing crystals in there? Those are little druzy pockets. I just, I almost want to cry. I am so thrilled with this. This is all so pretty. I just, I want to cry. I have a crystal collection, guys. I have a crystal collection. <laughs> this is a rose quartz. They call them mountains. They stand like this, like a little mountain. But look at, can you see the little rainbows in here from the crackle inside the stone? So pretty. But you can see how dark this one is compared to how light this one is. Both rose quartz, just different levels of color. Let's see what's in this one. I'm telling you, this is like Christmas. There's like little packets of joy. Oh, this is my smoky quartz flame. Now, it looks like, you know, there's bits and pieces busted, but that is actually just inside the rock. That's how it's formed like this little piece here that crackle it gives off little rainbow flashes that probably aren't showing up on camera but it is gorgeous look at how pretty this is all right let's get this one. Oh, this is one of my spheres oh, oh look at look at how pretty I'm not sure what this is, if it's a mazonite or something else, or amazonite or however you want to say it, but it's so pretty. It's like a good sized sphere. And I'm going to plop it in that little holder right there. All right. I got to tell you guys, they did a fantastic job on the packing. Like it's all so well packed. It's, yeah, a bit of a pain to unpack it, but it's all protected. Because when you get things like this, <laughs> this is a fire quartz sphere. Come on, focus. Hello, there we go. Look at this. Look at how pretty. Oh. It's so dreamy and look at the size of it. Like these two spheres alone. Oh, I can't tell you how heavy these are. I think that one will look better on the black. This is how excited I am. <laughs> this is one of my lions. This is my fluorite lion. 
Look at the colors. He's purple across here, green across here. There's a little bit of yellow in his foot. But look at how pretty he is. So the great thing about my fluoride lion is he's got a brother in Dream Amethyst. So it's a pair of lions. So that's the pair. Are they not adorable? Look at those little stern faces. And their little tails. Look at their tails. They're so cute. And we'll get on to the next one. Oh, so pretty. This is like a flashy black stone. I don't want to say that it's obsidian because there's a very specific classification for obsidian but it's got little sparkles and rainbows in it so I might have to look into this more so this is an agate star it's got very pretty patterns in it but look how chunky this boy is like we're not playing around this is a chunky star it's so pretty oh there's one more in here guess what it is Look at, look at the dark flecks there. Oh, the beautiful band of white. Look at that little circle here. That's pretty typical of an agate is those circle patterns. Oh, so pretty. We're getting down there, guys. So you're bored? I hope you're not bored because I am having the time of my life right now. <laughs> and here's the little tower with its protected oh that is a sharp point look at how pretty i have no idea what it is oh there is a little more flash right there can you see it right in here it's like little pyrite flex maybe so this is an orca agate and i think you can see why they call it an orca agate i don't know about the healing power of crystals and all that i won't negate it out of hand because there's so much we don't understand but as far as beauty goes amazing i could just stare at them i'm gonna guess this is like a red jasper but i don't know okay so there's still some glue on the tip of this one i'm gonna worry about getting that off with heat but look at these colors now you can see how it's got kind of that opaque look to it that's why i'm thinking it's jasper Okay, so we have that little tower. So we have two packages left. We have this little one and this big one. I bet you can't guess what the big one is. Yes, it's a tower. So this would be like probably a flower or a moss agate. You can see the pretty patterns in it. And again, this is a pretty chunky boy. Like these aren't just little teeny tiny cuttings. All right, and here's the last one. This is like 80 pounds, obviously a tower. And I probably have no idea what the stone is, but we're gonna get into it anyways. Look at this. I think it's lemon quartz. It does have little rainbows in it that you probably can't see, unfortunately, but got little pockets and rainbows and this big stripe of orange going all the way through it and it is absolutely stunning just stunning I can't even oh, you probably can't see in here but there's like a little pocket inside of this see-through section here just stunning oh my gosh look at the size of that Oh my goodness, it's absolutely gorgeous. Just stunning. Let me get some close-ups of these. And I'll insert them so you can get a closer look at some of these crystals if you're interested. If not, you know, it's fine if you want to leave. You won't hurt my feelings. Even though we haven't visited in like a month. Because I've been off sick. Oof. I have to say I'm pretty glad that they're uh, hardy crystals. That was my uh, Orca Jasper, but it's fine. I think it dented my floor. 
<laughs> it didn't get the crystals. So let me get a few close-ups of these. So that's it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this. I mean, I know it's not our normal content, but it's fun. And and there's six more boxes coming. <laughs> I still can't believe I did that. <laughs> but then I'm looking at this and I just my heart is so happy. And these are my new friends. My little twin lions. Well, they're not twins. They're brothers. My little brother lions. They're so cute. Oh, I'm just so happy. Hopefully I'll have videos out next week that aren't crystals. <laughs> Although honestly, what's not to love about them? Pretty rocks. There's nothing wrong with pretty rocks, right? <laughs> Thanks for joining me, guys. I'll see you later. Bye.